today we're going to be doing another DIY and I will be making a drum roll please if you haven't guessed it is a spa like bathroom mat um, it's pretty much a river stone mat so I chose two different types of stones I have these kind of like flat flat rocks river rocks if you will and these are like all black and I wanted to spice it up and include these ones which are a variety of different colors and so yeah let's jump right into this so what you will need for this DIY aside from the obvious you'll need your rocks of course and I'm I'm hoping guys I have five bags um, my mat is a 19.5 by 31.5 so hopefully you guys can see the size I don't know whether or not five bags is sufficient but we're gonna we're gonna see so this is how I hope I know the angle is not the best guys but let me see so there we go this is the length and pretty much the width of it right so again this is going to be for the bathroom um, you could use this as a welcome mat as well but I want more um, I guess of a spa like feel when you step out of the bath and um, that's the purpose of making this mat so that being said you'll need your floor mat whatever size you choose you'll need your rocks whatever colors you choose and you will also need an adhesive so I have two kinds um, I thought I would need something a little bit stronger than my glue gun so I picked this one up at the dollar store it's a fix-all cement I'm hoping that this works but if it doesn't I do have a backup which is Gorilla Glue. Not for hair, but for mats. So, let's take a look and see how this turns out. I should have used more of the brown uh, rocks so that the black writing can stand out so I don't think you guys I don't know if you guys can see but we have what word do, uh, do we have there in the middle uh, a little gap well a medium gap no what word do we have home home H yeah O M E <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so next time um, we will do the lettering in all black and we'll do the rest of the mat in brown. That way the letters stand out more. But yeah, basically the mat says home and we are in the last stretch. We've got just that little patch and yeah, stay tuned to see the finished product guys. Okay, go. Good job. Thank you. It's the final piece of the puzzle. This is a puzzle? Yeah, kind of. Okay. Yeah. Yay, he did it. Yeah. Woo! Disco, disco. Disco. He's doing his disco dance. Good job. Please. <laughs> I don't know why your shirt is so dirty, but... All right, guys, so there we have our final product. So this is our uh, DIY um, spa, spa mat. Yeah. So, yeah, I uh, hope you guys like it. Um, I would 
probably suggest that for your first time, maybe small, um, start, maybe small, <laughs> maybe start with a smaller mat. So I would do half. Um, and then that way, you know, you can kind of get a feel for it. Um, we ended up using three different, uh, contact cement. Well, two of these contact cement and then gorilla, uh, gorilla glue. So yeah, three days later, but we're really happy um with the end result and we hope you guys like it as always don't forget to like comment and subscribe